do, 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 do. So I've heard a lot of people rave about this particular. I, I... Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Omolade Ibikunle, and if this is your first time stopping by, I've prepared a nice seat for you guys. I've decorated it with red velvet material and I've inscribed the words subscribe on it. It's right there. Just make yourself comfortable and click on it. Okay, and if you are coming by, you've always come by, you've always watched my video, or you have not subscribed yet. I mean, what are you, what are you waiting for? Please, just subscribe. That's all I ask. Hey, I'll be doing okay. a, I don't know, a review, a wear test of the Pond Lasting Oil Control Instant Shine Free. I didn't say it. Pond said it. So I've heard a lot of people rave about this particular. I, I, I've heard a lot of people rave about this particular. Will I call it primer? I don't know. Maybe primer. Since I've talked about it, the CME talked about it in one of her videos, and I just thought to buy and share because if you know me, you know my face and oil. We are like buddies. We are best friends. So I'm going to be trying this today and I'm going to be doing a wear test. This is how it comes. The packaging is like this. Pond Lasting Oil Control Vanishing Cream for very oily skin. It says it's expertly designed to absorb excess oil and prevent skin problems from oil buildup. Okay, so some skincare. Throw in some skincare. It says um, it's expertly designed for African skin to neutralize excess oil and nourish skin deep inside within the epidermis. Hmm. Okay, a lot of promise. It's a lot of promise. This is what you get when you buy it and this is what it looks like on the inside Ooh, it's just a cute box container so I've gone ahead to do my eyes and my eyebrow because I don't want this video to be long I mean I didn't do anything for my eyes just brown eyeshadow and then I popped on my lashes and then I've must gone to moisturize my face so after that, obviously, the first thing we'll do is to prime the face. So I really don't know how much products I'm supposed to apply, but I'll just go as my gut tell me. I'll concentrate this on areas I produce oil the most, which is around my around my eyes my nose, my forehead. It feels like moisturizer. So, am I looking matte yet? It instantly makes your face dry. You know, gives that, like it's going to stay matte all day kind of finish it smells nice you know ponds always smells nice do you remember ponds powder the one we use before we started using brown powder yeah it smells like that my face feels dry and smooth it's currently very hot here so there's no lights and if you're hearing noise it's because my neighbor's generators are on so this would be a nice time to actually test it because there's no light and it's quite hot. I'm going to go right now and you know just do the rest of my face. Normally after applying primer I always go in with setting powder but just so I can test the potency of this product I'm not going to use setting powder. I'm just going to go into color correcting, foundation and what have you. So very quickly I'm using my LA Girl Pro Conceal um, Corrector. Orange. 
I'm not going anywhere fancy to have um, orchestra rehearsal. And then I'll be back in the house. Moving on to foundation, and I'll be using my classic foundation. I don't want to use you know, any game game foundation because I'm not going anywhere, anyways. See this pimple right here? It's of the devil. And this one right here? of the devil's angel how can people come and situate itself in the middle of my face seriously i'm moving on now to conceal with my LA Girl pro conceal in pure beige <laughs> every time we're doing this when we do concealer why i think it's so the skin can stretch like ah uh -huh. So you stretch <laughs> okay guys don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like it and you like more videos like this it's really help me know what kind of content to plan I'm still at the phase of creating of planning content because I really don't know what you like what will resonate but I've noticed that lately my blogs my vlogs do well yeah so you really like vlogs like sides vlogs do you like beauty content like makeup even though i don't know how to do makeup very well but you know would you like my beginner style of makeup do you want me to continue doing it let me know sasha buttercup setting powder my milani powder in warm on the areas that I haven't set. I feel kind of different. My face feels so matte. By the way, I'm wearing a top hole. It's an off shoulder top. All of you start saying, <laughs> Lade, you were naked. You didn't wear clothes. You didn't something, something. I'm wearing a tube. No, I'm actually wearing an off shoulder top. So, my TC15, TC Cosmetics. Um, lipstick in forgotten the name so that's it guys um, I'm going to go ahead and shoot another video then go out I'm going to be checking with you from time to time it's currently 10 58 a.m. I don't know if you can see that you really can't see it I'm using the other phone to record it's 10 58 a.m. let's just say 11 let's just say I finish applying this at around 11 we'll see how this wears out throughout the day if this works for me ha ha i'll be so happy i'll be so so happy right now i like the finish of my makeup i don't know everything just glided well i don't know i i feel like my makeup and i didn't even use expensive foundation i use classic okay let me not even talk we'll check back in later bye for now so guys quick update what is the time now it's 4 14 right now so it's been 11, 11. <laughs> what it's been about five hours <laughs> this is five hours of wear i've put my face through a lot today I had light issues, so I've been going down, up and down the staircase, and I've sweated a lot. I had to dab off the sweat. Now, the most interesting thing is that when, when, when I started sweating, it didn't divide my makeup. I, the sweat just rose above the makeup. I've gone to make my hair. People have touched my face when I was in my old back. So. This is how it's looking. I don't know if this will be the final check-in or I'll have one more check-in. I think I'll have one more check-in just for, just one more check-in. Okay, bye. Hey guys, so this is the final check-in. I've had this makeup on for 
for seven and a half hours now. It's currently 6.30 and I put this on at 10.58. So plus or minus seven and a half hours. <sighs> it worked so well. The primer worked so well, guys. I mean, my, my face has an healthy amount of glow, but my makeup is not apart. It still feels super nice. This product, Pond's Oil Vanishing Cream, gets a big thumbs up for me. And remember, I did not powder after I applied primer. So it's just primer, foundation, then powder. And it looks like this. So it gets an A1 from me. I'm going to recommend it to every African woman with highly oily skin or anybody with oily skin generally. So that'll be all guys. Don't forget to like, thumbs up, and subscribe, leave a comment, like more especially because I want to know what kind of videos you like and this would help me sift through you know, the kind of videos you like. Yeah. So till next time, bye.